in New York. It's late night with Conan O'Brien. Welcome to the show. We have a, uh, we got a fine program. A few people tonight. We've got a lot of fun stuff planned. And uh, just before I walked out here, true story, I usually have a little tea just before I come out. First time ever in seven years. I'm just about to come out. I brush up against something. The whole thing of tea goes all the way down my leg. Oh, just wow. seconds before I went down. Look at that. It looks, it looks like, oh, wait, wait. I like how I thought you were laughing that I spilled tea. It was the shocking whiteness of my leg. <laughs> That's the saddest thing ever. I hear laughing like, oh, that really killed the tea. Oh, wait a minute. I have the leg of a cadaver. Look at that. <laughs> this is how I'm doing the monologue from now on. <laughs> Why are they all laughing at me? <laughs> Mom, why? Why do they mock me so? We got a great show, though, despite my antics. And that'll dry off in a little bit, sure. don't you think? Well, All if right. it really is tea. <laughs> I'm getting nervous. It's tea. Uh. We, uh, we got a great show. We had a lot of fun stuff planned. And uh, a few things to discuss in the, uh, actually, in the world of politics. True story, a little odd, but true, uh, due to a problem, I don't know if you heard about this, but due to a problem that they were having yesterday with Air Force Two, which is the way that, that uh, he usually flies, Al Gore had to take a U.S. Airways shuttle back to Washington yesterday. He had to get on the U.S. Airways shuttle and fly back. And uh, reportedly, Gore spent the entire flight in the full upright and locked position. <laughs> All right. We'll show my bare leg in another minute, just kind of. <laughs> Clearly We're that's much more them. comical than anything we've come up with. Yeah. <laughs> show it again, freak! <laughs> it's like I have no blood. <laughs> uh, what else is going on? According to, uh, according to exit polls in New Hampshire, they're just finding out, you know, what was on the voters' minds. Voters liked John McCain, apparently, because he says whatever he thinks. That's what they're saying. Yeah, as opposed to uh, George W. Bush, who says whatever he can pronounce. <laughs> Other news, it's been reported, it's been reported that uh, Mayor Giuliani, who, of course, is uh, running for Senate, Mayor Giuliani has received a campaign donation from Wheel of Fortune host Pat Sajak. That's right, yeah, apparently uh, Sajak donated $1,000 and two vowels. <laughs> I'm a person, not a piece of meat. You really ought to, you should just leave it up. Just leave it up? Yeah, just leave it All up. All right. That, I'm actually getting warmth from it. <laughs> you know, folks, it was in the news today. I like anyone tuning in right now yeah. thinks that he's, you know, I've, I'm starting to lose it gradually on the air. <laughs> True story, it was reported today that, did you know this? Kate Moss, 
Kate Moss has been visiting a fertility specialist. Did you know that? She's visiting a fertility specialist. And uh, when asked about it, Kate said that uh, she plans on eating a fertility pill over the course of the next several weeks. Wesley <laughs> munched away on it. All right. We, uh... We're, uh... Let's talk about tonight's show. Let's talk about tonight's show. Uh, we got a great one for you this evening. Uh, I love this guy. This guy's a great guest. You know him from the... Uh, I didn't say who it was yet. <laughs> Hee Haw star Junior Samples, ladies and gentlemen. You know. Uh, you know him from the films Eyes Wide Shut. He was in Goldeneye. He got a Tony Award uh, winning role in Cabaret. He's also hosting Saturday Night Live this weekend. Alan Cumming on the show. Very cool. We also have from the uh, from the new movie Scream Three, Parker Posey here, and I'm excited, ladies and gentlemen. We have great musical guests tonight live on the show. And sitting right over there, uh, wearing long pants, Max Weinberg and the Max Weinberg 7 Max. <laughs> Andy, what's up? 